You might see lots of Hollywood movies with a teal and orange look, which is very really awesome and professional when it's come to the color grading or a cinematic look. I will love to do in this video in two or three steps, easy steps to get the cinematic teal and orange look to any footage that you have with you. So I decided to do this technique in three programs uh, and separately three programs that you can achieve in any program that you are working on it like DaVinci Resolve Final Cut Pro and the Premiere Pro. So stay with us till end of the video and enjoy the three steps to get the professional and awesome cinematic look of teal and orange coming up. Okay, so let's start the teal and orange color grading. I will have to go with DaVinci Resolve first. So let's open the DaVinci Resolve. Yes, I have this already and I have here with me the three clips. So I will have to go with this one. Let's import it on the timeline and let's get jump to the color tab. Yep, so let's turn off the clips. I will have to see the full screen of the preview. So let's preview the clips once. Yep, it's a perfect. So we're going to work on the one single note with two steps that we can get the teal and orange look. So let's first isolate the skin tone from the qualifier. Just click on the qualifier and pick up the skin and turn on the highlight to see the result. And from the plus point, you can select furthermore the skin and the areas that you want to uh, be isolated in the uh, orange part of your image. So let's denise a little bit and click the black as well white a little bit blurness okay so we can bring some changes on our qualifier from here mm -hmm. i think it looks perfect let's clean a little bit the white I think it's perfect. Okay, so let's invert this and apply the tilt color on our background. So from the primary wheels, we will go from the offset wheels, push to the tilt color, something like this. Let's turn off the highlighter and see the result. Boom. Perfect. Is that simple? You see the changes? Yep. Okay. Oops. <laughs> Let me play this again okay I'm pretty sure you see the changes yeah so it's that simple we're working on now in one node which is the only one node so let's create another node we don't want to up, uh, we don't want to get the teal color on our black part of our image so let's turn on uh, let's create another node okay let's jump to the Lumo versus saturation and create a dot from here and push down the black area. Is that simple? Okay, something like this. Brilliant. Boom. We're done. Oh. As you can see the changes, brilliant. So this was the first for the DaVinci Resolve. So let's move to the Final Cut Pro, we will do the same in this Final Cut Pro to get the teal and orange look. I have already imported my media here, as you can see the same clip is here. So let's go to the effect, and after that from the correction, we will choose color wheels. From here we will create a mask, add color mask. From here we will pick the qualifier and draw a little bit for the skin tone to isolate it, something like this. And select the outside, like invert it, and after that, push the till to the background. Mm, something like this. Boom. As you can see, 
and two three steps very easy steps we got the teal and orange look and the final cut final cut pro x something like this so i don't want to have the teal color on my shadows so let's add the hue saturation and from the luma versus saturation we will down the blue channel to our shadows something like this perfect in my point of view i have to decrease the orange color from the skin as well from the hue or saturation we will click the highlighter to select the skin tone and we will push down a little bit the color boom perfect it's that simple to get the teal and orange look in any program that you want especially in the final cut pro which is awesome and professional in color grading terms so this was for the final cut pro so let's get jump to the premiere pro for doing the same as well wait wait guys i will not go to do this teal and orange color grading in the premiere pro because i want to leave this for you guys i will challenge you guys to do the same thing in premiere pro and comment down below in my this video just only the steps which steps do you want to take to get the thin and orange especially as you can see i got the steps in two and three easy steps to get the thin and orange look so for those who will be done this i will be share definitely a giveaway pack which will be a free and fresh lads from creative.xyz well with that said i will wait for you guys to comment down below your idea or your tracks to get that teal and orange look as my point of view this was the basics and very easiest way to get the teal and orange look to your footage there's lots of video in youtube that you can watch and you can get the teal and orange look to your footage but they will spend lots of time to get this job done i hope you guys like the video if you did hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe our channel meanwhile i have to mention our creatube.xyz website which will give you free and fresh lab updated every week so don't forget to sign up over there and get your fresh lads every day updated at the end i will see you 